Welcome to the class. Myself Ashwini, lecturer in statistics. Today's class topic is about weighted average price relatives using arithmetic mean and the geometric mean. Last in the last classes we have solved the averages using AMGM for unweighted price relatives. So in this class we are going to solve the weighted average price relatives methods using arithmetic mean and the geometric mean. And this is first problem calculate price index by weighted average of price relatives method using AM. AM is nothing but arithmetic mean and this is the data they have given and prices of 2005 and price of 2000 and they have given weights see in this problem they have given price of 2005 and 2010 and the weights how much they have taken and the price of 2005 will consider it as base year and price of 2010 we consider it as current year so i will denote price of 2005 as p0 and price of 2010 is p1 and this weight i denoted by w as we know that it is a price relative first we have to write the capital p that is price relative values so that for that it is P, capital P price relative is P1 by P0 into 100. So P1 by P0 into 100 and the next column is P into W. That is after finding the price relative values, then we will multiply this price relative value with the weights. Then we will take the summation and this P1 by P0 values are like this 137.5. 160 and the 200 and next this pw that is this p price relative with weight or we can write it as w into p also pw or wp weight into price relative that is weight this weight column should be multiplied with the price relative column that is 4 into 133.33 and similarly we will get all the values that is 533.32 for 12.5, 320 and 200. Next is formula. That is using AM, price relative using AM. You can write like this, this is AM. It is summation of WP, that is weight into price relative, summation of W, that is summation of W is the total of weight. The total of weight what we have written here, that total we have to take and the total of P into W, that is summation W is 10 and summation of WP is 1465.32. Then you substitute summation W and summation of WOP in the formula. Say in this price relative, here we will not multiply this with the 100 because we are already multiplied that 100 in price relative P already. So we will not multiply the 100 in this formula. Just we will substitute the values. That is 1465.82 divided by 10. So our price relative value is 
price relative value using AM that is arithmetic mean. Next one. Here again we should calculate the price index number by weighted average price relatives method using GM that is geometric mean. For that we are having a problem like this. It is items and they have given the weights. Here they have given expenses, expenses in percentage that is 30, 15, 20, 10 and 25. Here they have given this expense in the percentage but we will not convert this to anything. We will not convert this. And the price of base year and a current year base year, current year and as we know our base year price is P0 and current year price is P1 and this expenses we will denote it as W. Next. To find price relative using GM, we have a formula like anti log summation log W summation W into log P divided by summation of W. Again, in this formula also, we will not multiply by 100 because in table itself, we are already multiplied the 100 while finding the price relative. First step is find the value of P, capital P, that is P1 by P0 into 100. Our price relative values are 90, 100. 85.7, 75, 37.5. Next, we have to find log value that is log P, log capital P. For this column, we are having capital P value that is price relative. For these values, we have to find the log. In scientific calculator, we know to find the logarithm, log values. So, it is 1.54. 2933 1.875 2.138 then you multiply this weight or expense column with log p column that is w into log p say here this is very important this log P column should be multiplied with the expense. Expense we are considered it as W that is weight, expense, whatever it may be. Now you should multiply this expense <coughs> column with log P column so that the values are like this 58.626, 30, 30 38.66, 18.751. 53.457 and we have to take the summation of W into log P that is 199.494 and for our formula we need the value or a summation of W and this summation W is 100. Now you substitute summation of W log P and summation W in the formula so that it is anti log 199.494 by 100 this is anti log 1.9949 see here first you have to divide then 
you have to take the anti log got it first you have to divide summation w log p divided by summation w then you take the anti log so that the price relative value is 98.33 after finding the anti log you will get the price relative value for gm as 98.33 and the next problem is same thing price relative using both the methods that is am and gm using am and gm here expenses it should be always in percentage it is food 30% rent 15% clothing 20% fuel 10% other 25% and the price for 2000 and 2001 20 24 and in this problem this expenses they have given in the weight or percentage and this expense we can denote it as w and the price of 2000 we will take it as base year and price of 2000 we will consider it as current year so this is p not and p1 and the next step is we have to find the price relative p capital p that is capital p is equal to p1 by p0 into 100 p1 by p0 into 100 it is 91.66 189.28 89.28 and 130 we know the formula of for am that is summation of wp by summation w and similarly for gm it is anti log summation of w log p by summation w so for this am we have to find w into p and for uh, gm we have to find log p and w first we will solve for am that is wp w into p w is nothing but the expense column or and we denote it as weight and the wp is 2749.8150017853.33250 and this total is 10118.7 now we substitute that and we want summation w since this is in percentage this summation w is nothing but 100 substitute the values 10118.7 divided by 100 so that the value is 101.187 that is price relative using am and the next thing is price relative using gm to find gm first we want to find log p already we have cal calculated the p value that is price relative take the log for that log p and the log p values are 1.96212 1.9507 1.9208 
2.1139 and next column is W into log P that is our expense column we uh, denote it as W and this values should be multiplied by log P. You just consider these values even though it is in percentage we will not consider the percentage simply we will take the numbers so that W into log P is 58.836, 30, 39.014, 19.208, 52.8475 and this summation is 199.9325. Now you substitute the summation W log P that is anti log of summation W log P is 199.9325 and summation W is 100. First you have to divide the values then you take the anti log. So that anti log 1.999325 so P01 of GM using GM is 99.8446. After finding, after dividing that, you have to take the anti-log so that you will get the GM value. Thank you.